Mother, humanitarian and long-distance runner, Eloise Wellings is on a mission. After years of injury, the 33-year-old Australian has qualified for her second Olympics and she's hoping her success on the track will mean a brighter future for Ugandan women. Footsteps for hope, a time for Eloise Wellings to think not just about the Rio Games, but also the plight of women in Uganda. Yeah, be just running along and, and the faces just pop into my head and I just remember, you know, why I do it and why I run. These are the faces Welling sees and the ones her Love Mercy Foundation was established for. Its new project is called Sense for Seeds, a micro-loan farming program empowering Ugandan women. And she receives 30 kilos of seeds and with those seeds she goes and grows and harvests those seeds and out of that she averages between 150 to 300 kilos of food. Love Mercy is launching a documentary about the program this week. Wellings integral to the goal of helping over 6,000 women in one of the world's poorest nations. The reason that she runs is to bring awareness to our projects and our programs and that's her motivation for training every day and for getting out and leaving it all out on the track. Eloise adds her humanitarian work and motherhood to an already busy Olympic training schedule. Every week, she runs the equivalent of about three marathons. Come on, mate, keep coming. Oh. Willings is a 5,000 and 10,000 metre specialist. Making the London 2012 team was a dream come true. Her approach this time around, in a word, fearless. And Rio is about, um, you know, trying to get the best out of myself and absolutely, you know, trying to give, you know, an out of my skin performance and, you know, to do that we need to take measured risks. The aim for Rio is a top eight finish, a lofty goal, even if Wellings is chasing a dream in Uganda greater than any Olympic Games. Darren Mara, SBS World News. And finally in sport, the